Ketchup slices are coming to your grocery stores, but the company behind them is being slammed for copying a product called ketchup leather. And in the words of Kris Jenner, I gotta say, this is a case for the FBI. A food entrepreneur named Emily Williams and her business partner have started a Kickstarter campaign to mass produce a new product called Slice of Sauce. Slice of Sauce is basically everyone's favorite condiment, except me. It's ketchup in slice form. The ketchup slices are shaped and packaged like Kraft Singles and seem to have a similar texture to fruit roll-ups. Is anyone out there thinking this sounds good? I don't know, just me kind of like throwing up in their mouths? Anyways, the ketchup slices come in packs of eight and are quote, all natural, no preservatives. They also don't require any refrigeration and their shelf life is about a year. Emily and her partner launched their Kickstarter campaign on March 6th in the hopes of bringing slice of sauce to grocery stores all around the country. So if the campaign meets its $15,000 goal, which it looks like it's gonna happen, the ketchup slices will be available at American grocery stores and on shelves as early as this summer. But there have been mixed reactions to slice of sauce to say the least. One person tweeted, quote, I just discovered something called a ketchup slice and it's an absolute abomination, a crime. Just don't do it. I don't want a ketchup fruit roll up or anything that resembles a processed slice of ketchup. If someone I know is using this new product, I will disown them in public. While another wrote, that is simply horrifying. It's so funny how we're reading my tweets on this show. Just kidding. But despite many being grossed out by the idea of sliced ketchup, I'm sorry, every time I say that, I'm just like, whoa. So the prospect of having a condiment that isn't messy is still kind of cool. One fan tweeted out saying, quote, I'm so ready for a ketchup slice on my bacon and egg burger. My mouth is watering at the prospect. Okay, but to be fair, bacon and egg plus anything would have your mouth watering, right? Another criticism of the ketchup slices came from food blog Munchies, which pointed out that another chef from a restaurant called Plan Check in LA already invented them. That chef called his creation ketchup leather, and it came out of the idea of dehydrating ketchup, cutting it into square slices, and putting it on a burger, which, yeah, that sounds like exactly the same thing. Emily Williams has since commented on the copycat criticism, explaining in a statement, quote, I was vaguely aware of a ketchup leather used at a restaurant, but I had never seen it in stores. We're excited to take our patent pending slice of sauce to the grocery market for consumers to enjoy either at home or on the go. We have plans to add more globally inspired flavors, including the barbecue sauce that is responsible for launching us into the slice age. All right, everybody, like, do we need this? Do we really, are we all like dying for slices of mustard and barbecue sauce? What's next? Slices of ranch? I, I'm sorry, this is too much for me. Are you guys totally grossed out? Or are you super excited? Cause if that's you, do you, I'm happy for you. What other flavors are you hoping this slice of sauce individuals come out with? Please sound off in the comments below, then click right over here to check out Starbucks new crystal ball frappuccinos. Once you're done with that, be sure to subscribe for more clever news. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Jocelyn Davis. I'll see you soon.